Investigation into Bexley's first murder in years goes cold. There's a new plea for information, not just from police, but the family now. 18-year-old Rudy Calmes Jr. was found shot to death January 23rd near Del Mar and Stanwood. That's where 10 TV's Shelby Croft is live tonight. Shelby, you spoke with Rudy's mother. His understandably very distraught mother. Now, Rudy Calmes was found right here. This is where his car was. Now, take a look. This is literally just down the street from the police station here. But investigators don't know why he was here or why he was shot. Now, keep in mind, the family doesn't want their faces on camera for safety reasons. And that's him holding his baby when he was, when he was born. Rudy Calmes was a brand new father when he was shot to death on January 23rd. Knowing Rudy won't be here when he grows up, it breaks my heart. His girlfriend Deja grieves. His mother Monica is heartbroken. It was very senseless. Rudy didn't deserve this. He didn't deserve it. Rudy had asked to leave his job at Jets Pizza early that night. A very short time later, he was found by two passersby. Detectives say he was shot at close range in his car. He wound up lying in the snow, the car still in drive. As soon as I looked out the window, the Columbus police pulled up. And like my heart just dropped. Deja had talked to Rudy earlier in the day. When I talked to him, he sounded like he was nervous about something. But he never told me anything. Police can't figure out who Rudy shared his plans with. And they say that's the missing piece. They just don't know who he was meeting that night. Detectives and families say Rudy had been briefly involved in a credit card fraud case. Police can't interview certain people until the federal investigation is done. And no one is certain if that has anything to do with his murder. Rudy was staying at home. He was doing what he was supposed to do. He stepped up to the plate of being a great, wonderful father. Monica says her son was back in school with aspirations of college, realizing he now had a family to take care of. They took a lot from us. A lot. Whatever transpired that night, it wasn't worth this person, this individual taking Rudy's life. Now, detectives would like any help they can get in this case. If you have any information on Rudy Calmes's murder, please contact Bexley Police. Reporting live in Bexley, Shelby Croft, 10TV News.